My name is Gemma Garrett and I am a solicitor at Family Law Partners. There are a range of financial orders available to parties on divorce, including payment of lump sums, transfer of property, pension sharing and payment of maintenance. There are a range of different models available to parties in trying to resolve financial matters. They can try and resolve matters directly between themselves. They can seek the assistance of an independent and neutral mediator. They can go through solicitors and use the traditional model of solicitor-led negotiation or a slight variant of that by using what is known as the collaborative model of working. Or if everything else breaks down, the parties always have the ability to make a financial application to the courts. A new model of working that is becoming increasingly more popular is the use of private arbitration in family work as well, in which parties jointly instruct a private arbitrator to adjudicate for them on financial matters. With the exception of court proceedings and arbitration, if the parties are able to reach an agreement regarding financial matters by consent, it is always important to have that agreement written up into a legally binding consent order. If you are thinking about getting divorced, it is always worth obtaining some independent legal advice from a specialist family lawyer.